previously on Lala's Full Court Life. How is it living in the hotel? Horrible. How does he feel about that? He's kind of letting me handle the living stuff. And tonight, Mello's off the road, so we just want to enjoy our time together. First lady of New York is speaking. <laughs> All right, so I... Babe, she's uh, I'm making a toast. We're going to Turks and Caicos. We're wow. here. Wait, Hold that's on. the penis? That's the penis. And what are you supposed to do with it? Uh, Eat it. Oh, my God. Woo. Some of the choices you do make, it does affect or hurt people that you really care about, and that does bother me. I can't fix this for you. You have to stand up. To the bitties. Shouts out to all the <laughs> So I'm back from LA and Mellow's off the road, so it's just really good to have everybody in one place together. So we're just gonna start it off at the penthouse at the Gansevoort Park and then take it down to Asalina for dinner. So it's just gonna be a good time. Mel, how you like being in New York? I've only been a couple days. We've been on the road. What, are you happy to be here? It'd be good, though, once y'all get the house and get yeah. settled. Oh, we going crazy. Oh, Cayenne? <laughs> he hit me with, he said today, I said, yo, I can't, you know what I mean, I can't leave with y'all. I got a, I got a game at night. He said, so what time the game is? I said, I think 7.30, 8 o'clock. He said, so when it's dark? I said, yeah. He said, oh, it's light now. You can go with us right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I... Babe, she's standing up. I'm making a toast. First lady of New York is speaking. <laughs> I just would like oh, to make a toast, welcoming Mello to New York. We're here now. It's going to be a great experience. I'm very happy that you're here, and I know this is what you wanted. And we're going to take over. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes. Definitely happy to be back together with Mel. And I just want to enjoy our time together, because before you look up, he'll be back on the road again. So you just spend quality time together when you have it. Cheers to family being close. Cheers. Cheers. We gotta fix it. So the Knicks practice all the way in Westchester, New York. We have a hotel that's close to the practice facility. I don't think anybody who wants action wants to live all the way out in Westchester. There's absolutely nothing there. Nothing. Hi! Hey, baby! Hey! Yeah. What's up? This place is far. You think that I don't know that already? No, I just need to. Well, since I don't have any action, you guys tell me what's going on. Yo, Shoot, the everything. city. House Lissette. Oh, not too well, not too well. Huh? She said some mean things to me. Cayenne, so Auntie so Lissette so is being mean to Auntie Poe. Why? She wants Auntie Poe to come back to LA. She's upset because I'm not there. She doesn't feel like I do little things to show her that I miss her. Like, do you? I guess not. Do you want to fix it? Of course I do. Nothing I do is ever good enough. I know what I want. I want her to be my girlfriend. I love her. I have an idea. I want to play a game with you. I figured out a way to make you feel better. You ready? No. Here are three things, OK? You can pick any one, and whatever is unveiled is what I'm going to do for you to cheer you up. OK. Isn't that cool? It's really mm -hmm. cool. I'm kind of excited now. <laughs> Number one. Number one? You sure? There are three distinctly different things. Number two. Number two. <laughs> Fuck out of here. The contestant has unveiled number two to cure a broken heart. We will be taking a trip to Turks and Caicos oh, with friends. You lying. You lying. You lying. You serious. You serious. I've been
I've been thinking about taking a trip and this is the perfect opportunity. So this is the perfect time to do this. I was already gonna invite the girls to Turks and Caicos and I can think of a million reasons why we need to go on a trip right now. Poe's depressed about Lisette. Dice still isn't talking about the situation. I am living in a hotel in Westchester, New York with nothing to do. It's time to get out of here and get our minds right. Poe, I hate to be like <laughs> a bitch about it, but glad you was feeling bad today. Oh, no! <laughs> We're going to Turks and Caicos. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. just arrived at the Gansevoort Turks and Caicos, and this place is beautiful. I decided to invite Kelly as well because she's been working really hard with her album and traveling, and I couldn't think of a better group of people to spend such a great vacation with. First we time, have yes. to help my cousin. I'm she's a sure. little under the weather. Yeah. Oh, thank you, thank you. Get some rum in you. Yeah, I'm she said get some I rum in you. Okay. Look at this outfit she's wearing for idea. Turks and Caicos. Oh, yeah. This is amazing. I'm just in awe of what a beautiful place Turks and Caicos is. I'm so happy to be out of New York. All right, so let's make a toast to a wonderful girl's trip in Turks and Caicos. Yay! Yay. What happened? Okay. Feel so better already, don't you? Food. All right, we're going to tuck you into bed for a rest, and we're going <laughs> to the bar to drink more and get more food. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I'm right. having right. fun without me. It's not fair. Don't leave me by myself for too long. This is paradise, ladies. Absolutely. Dun, Love dun, this. Dun, dun. Everything is looking on the up and up. Poe is smiling and happy. Dice isn't feeling that good, but with a little rest and relaxation, she's going to be fine. Oh, it's so nice here. This is awesome. You guys have bathing suits on? I'm naked under here. Really? <laughs> Even better. Skinny dipping. This is the perfect place for a girl's getaway. Being on a beautiful tropical island, the first thing you have to do is test the water out. Yo, this water <laughs> feels so good. <laughs> we need a beverage. Would that be an alcoholic beverage? Something with love. Oh, Kel, she got another one. What? Tattoo. Oh, yeah, I got another oh, tattoo. Oh, she's addicted now. Did you know she got? Yeah, I know. All right, let's go hit the pool. After spending the afternoon at the pool, we're going to my favorite place, the casino. Here we go. Okay, Hello, sir. Kelly, you know how to play blackjack? Hey, Don't I worry, I'm here to answer all your questions. Kelly doesn't really know how to play, but I am a blackjack master, so I'm gonna give her some pointers. No set of moves without consulting. Oh! Yeah, Kel. You got 21. Right, wow. Bang. Five winning. All I do is win, win. Yeah. Win the whole thing. Okay. Win the whole stack. This is Turks. This is Turks. Hey, Kel. Kel. Go out with a win. Oh, 25. Oh! As you can see, she doesn't need my help anymore. Now it's time for me to clean house. I need some new shoes, baby. Dollar. I need Damn, man. Oh, yeah. Pay me, pay me, pay me right. Ah, ah, yes. Shit. Ah, yikes. Ah, same thing with you. Y'all uh, just, just need to give them your money on this. You want even money? Yikes. I can't win a hand. <laughs> That's all I got. That's my last 300. I'm out of here. Look at this. Ah. <laughs> Maybe I ain't getting no new pair of shoes this trip, dollar. Good morning. Hi. 
Hi, I'm Captain Bill. Dice. Hey. Nice to meet you, Dice. Welcome to the Panopoly and uh, the Turks and Caicos Islands. We're going to have a fantastic day fishing, chasing so some uh, big wahoo or dolphin. Woo! So, right. Welcome nice. aboard. Thank you. Anytime I go on vacation, I love going on boat rides. It's what you're supposed to do when you're on a vacation. What have you seen out here before? Dolphins and whales. We still get whales this time of year, so you've got oh, a good chance wow. of that. Shark. Well, occasionally, but not very often. Yeah, sure. That's what they all say. It's funny how all it takes is some good friends, a boat, and some water to kind of make you forget about everything that's going on back home. And I think we all needed this right now. Ah. Ah. Ladies, welcome to Pine Key. Pine Key. This is actually a completely deserted beach. Never really comes here unless you've got a boat. There's nothing you need to be afraid of. Occasionally, we get Jojo the dolphin. He could be around. <laughs> Jojo. The waters of the Caribbean are so clear, so perfect. All I can think about is jumping in. Woo! Mermaid! Woo! She dove and everything. Woo! <laughs> You're next. I see a fin. I don't know if it's a shark, a dolphin, a stingray. I'm trying to get out the water. I see him! I see him! Go, 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 go. Dice and I swam to the closest shore we could find. And I'm stuck on the island because I don't want to get back in the water with the dolphin. Jojo decides to swim away, and I knew this was my chance to get back on the boat. I moved as quickly as I could to get my ass from that shore to that boat. Did you have fun? Yes, but I'm scared of that dog. Time to eat. Oh, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, to Cheers to the conk. Cheers to the conk. Yes. All right, ladies. We're going to give you a little bit of a conch demonstration. Conch is in there. Con yeah, conch. That's what This, this about is what conch is. It's, it's like having champagne in the champagne region, as if you couldn't get champagne anywhere else in the world. I got it. So that, it's, a, it's a delicacy here. So I'm being offered conch, and I've been wanting to try it. It's something that the people of Turks and Caicos love to eat. So I want to taste it. Like this. That. Now, the important thing to know is that it is not only super good for you, high in omega-3s and almost all protein, wow. there's also something called the pistol. You see that right there? That's Whoa. his penis, right? Who's, yeah. Wait, Hold that's on. the penis? That's the penis. That's the... And what are you supposed to do with it? Uh, eat it. Oh, my god. Ooh. You eat it. Heck no. It's, a, it's the island aphrodisiac. Now, you got to do it. Do it. No, man, not today. Come on. Well, are you supposed to try the penis oh, raw? Yeah. Yes, because we like it raw around here. What the? Because y'all like it raw around here. Oh, what's really going on? Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? Right. Does that come from Jamaica? They really? get straight at him. Let's just do a shot. One for you. Now, this is called a conch knocker shot. Lord. Generally, I'm pretty good at trying new things, but eating raw conch penis? Oh, hell no. Ah, oh, come on. Now. Are you freaking kidding me? All right. Ready? Oh, oh my God. Whoa. Are you right. kidding me? Does that come me? from Jamaica? They get really straight at him. Let's just do a shot. One for you. Now, this is called a conch knocker shot. Lord. Generally, I'm pretty good at trying new things, but eating raw conch penis, that's pushing it a little bit. Ladies are no, delicate. No, I don't want to. I'll no. split it I'll in try four. It's aphrodisiac. Great. Maybe we'll start feeling on each other. Let in the pencil. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. Amen. Oh, Lord. Cheers, ladies. Oh, Lord. Quest Cheers. tonight. <laughs> Did you taste the penis? Nope. Tastes good, though, right? <laughs> <laughs> Just swallow. What's that, bud? I haven't had penis in a long time. Oh, Lord! <laughs> there you go. Yes! What happens at a conch shack? Stay Stays at the conch shack. This is going to make me more sleepy. Uh-oh. Really? Y'all don't feel like the ocean water, like, kicked your butt? 
feel like that dolphin damn near kicked my <laughs> JoJo is harmless. Yeah, okay. Today definitely goes down in the books. We went on a boat ride and almost got killed by a dolphin. I ate conch penis. And the best part of it all is there's not a group of people I would rather share this much fun with. Did y'all come back here with your special someone? Absolutely. Of course. Would of you course. Pop? For sure. Of course I would. Dice, would you bring the situation? <laughs> Enough with the title, the situation. You know what the situation's name is. But I thought you wanted us to refer to her as the situation. It's not that, it's just that a lot of people, you know, probably wouldn't be accepting of it. Sometimes I just choose to keep my personal life private. It's very surprising that Dice would bring this up because this is a topic that she never likes to talk about. Some of the choices you do make, it does affect or hurt people that you really care about, and that does bother me. I understand that, but I find you apologizing for being this way. Who you are is not a mistake, and it's not nothing bad. You're right, but I don't want to disappoint anybody, and I guess I'm just so concerned about what they would think or how they would feel, and I shouldn't be that way. I just don't want you to feel like there's something wrong with you. And like, I want to fix this for you, but I can't fix this for you. You have to stand up, and until you let it all out, you're never really going to be happy. I see it. Everybody sees it. I mean, it's obvious. She's out to our family. We definitely know that Dice is gay, but to the outside world, I never hear her talk about that. And keeping a secret or not wanting to tell people who you are is hurtful, especially to Dice's girlfriend, Michelle. Like, from Michelle's perspective, okay, that's your girlfriend. Like, regardless if we were joking around or not, referring to her as a situation, whatever, like, how do you think that makes her feel? That's not putting her in a fair position. But that's not fair to her. I don't put her in a position. She's talked to me about it before, though. You gotta think of it from her perspective as well. That's somebody who really cares about you, loves you. Those are the people you should be really concerned about how they feel and what they think about stuff. The moment I met you, nothing but genuine, loyal. If anybody doesn't see that, Fuck you can't worry about it. Of course. Yeah. I don't know why I let it you know, bother me. I'm just glad that, you know, y'all love me the same and just accept me the same, because a lot of people don't have family like that. Anybody got your back, you know we do. We love you how we are, but we're excited to see you liberated and letting all this stuff off. We love you. We love you. Oh, it'll be all good. Look at this bonfire. Bonfire. You know what I mean? This yeah, is I gotta come so up out of my show. Awesome. So it's our last night here. The trip has flown by, but it was worth every second. Now everybody is recharged and ready to go back out in the world and do what we need to do. Thank you so much as always. Thank you. Absolutely. Uh, of course. Thank you. I feel like there's an element of this that's missing. Situation. The set. The situation. <laughs> the set. Carmelo. 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 You know? It's like, that would be cool if they could be here. This trip is what we needed, and we accomplished a lot. I'm really happy for Dice, and I'm excited to see what happens from here on out. As for me, I got one thing on my mind. I got to go back to New York and find us a place to live. Nobody wants to take a stroll with me? No. A lot of situation. Hey. Sorry. I need to, but it costs $1.99 per minute. <laughs> <laughs> Next on Lala's Full Court Life. He found another apartment to go look at. This really oh, wow. may be the one. When I start having important things, come. I always make time for you. This one's nice. Poe actually booked a show today, but this photo shoot's supposed to go really long. Oh, John, to come to the stage. <laughs> All right, guys. Last thing I want to do is miss Poe's performance. Hmm. Yo, you gotta do it, Poe. <laughs> oh shit, it's crazy. You gotta do it. Hold on. I'm scared. No, go ahead. I'm right here with you. <laughs> Please stay with me. <laughs> <laughs> this shit 
is crazy, right?